Hey guys, Papa Pete back again today. Another episode of All Guys and Old Games. Joined by Coco here in the basket. And uh, we'll get another television homebrew to bring to you today that's upcoming uh, from Intellivision Revolution. It has got a very similar backstory to the one I brought you last week called Mermaid in the fact that it was started to be developed way back, probably like uh, seven years ago. In April of 2017, a programmer named Marco Morero uh, started this game uh, on the heels of the first game that he created, which was Space Versus. Now, Space Versus finally got a complete uh, physical release back. It was going to be PRGE 2023. It ended up being delayed a little bit. It was released in December of 2023. And now uh, they picked up production. Marco himself has picked up production and work on this game, his Princess Liddy game he originally created again back in 2017. Um, it, in fact, not only has he developed this game a little bit more, he's actually... Uh, created a new version, and this, in reality, is Princess Liddy Plus. Uh, it used to be just like an arcade-style game, sort of framed around uh, a Mario Brothers type game. Okay, if you remember, not Super Mario Brothers, but Mario Brothers itself. But in all actuality, when I watched it first time and saw it played and played it myself, it reminds me much more of a game that I love totally. Such a great game, and that's Bubble Bobble. Uh, it's got that type of style. Uh, there's a storyline to go with it. Uh, that's part of the plus aspect that he has added to it. But uh, man, yeah, this is a really neat little game. Really has a lot more development to be done. I'm showing you a beta version, which isn't early, but there's different aspects I'll talk about as we're actually playing it. But before we go any further, let's take a look at the backstory of the game. And I'll ch uh, read it to you right here off the back of the box. And you can see what's being uh, built up for the game. The, what, what is making this arcade game plus. Okay, so here we go. A war has been raging between two ancient royal families for ages. In the latest act of aggression between the combatants, Princess Liddy, the youngest daughter of the wise King Christian, was kidnapped and imprisoned by the evil forces of Archbishop Hirschberger. Hirschberger, yeah, where's that come from, I wonder? A ransom demand was sent to Liddy's family, demanding brutal concessions in exchange for her safe return. But unbeknownst to the Hirschbergers, Liddy is an advanced student of martial arts, and she easily managed to escape from her dungeon cell. Now she must battle her way out of the Hirschberger Fortress, fighting all the evil creatures and other forces that will try to thwart her fight for freedom. Help Liddy defeat scores of nasty monsters and make her way through multiple levels of the vast Hirschberger Castle and ultimately escape the evil clutches of her kidnappers and return to the welcoming arms of her beloved family. So that is the premise of the game, which is beautiful, right? You get a lot of, that that's you have to have these games have to have a storyline behind them. So that, that's a lot of fun. Anyway, like I said, I'm gonna play it right now. There's a lot more work to be done. I'm gonna tell you this right now. I'm going to die lots in this game. I'm just going to show you a couple levels uh, because right now, as part of the debug, eh, the game won't end by die. You don't lose a life when you die. Okay, you will if you run out of time. Uh, you'll see that too. Anyway, without any further ado, let's play a little bit of Princess Liddy so you can see what's coming. And gotta love that Bubble Bobble style. All right, here we go. Princess Liddy, let's start her right up. There's no voice in this game that I've heard. Uh, maybe there'll be some added, I don't know, but I don't think so. Start off, of course. Got the Intellivision Revolution Splash Green, which you always get to see. Love it. Love it. He's had this one now for a couple of years. I like it. I like the old one, too. So, okay. Princess Liddy Plus. Two princesses. Copyright 2016 to 24. So he's been working on it since 2016. I said in the intro there that it, it was April 2017 that he started. Well, in all actuality, that was when he first posted it on Atari Age, right? So he'd been working on it for a while so, uh, before that. So anyway, let's get right at it. Uh, we'll start. Of course, what do you got for different options here? We got uh, one player or two player. It does have password. There are settings here. So let's go to the settings, see what it says. Hit number four. Music on and off. Two player flicker. Back to the title screen or extras. We'll go into extras, see what that does. Sound player, memory map, credits. Let's look at the credits real quick. I always like to look at the credits. Thanks to testers, Patricia and Rev, and also everyone helping in the Atari Age and Television Programming Forum. So that's awesome that he, that uh, Marco uh, gives thanks to all those people. Let's jump right into the game. All right. 
So round one, land one. I like the music of this game too. Really good music. Score zero. Three lives we watched. That won't change a whole lot. So the first land, there's eight different lands, four levels in each one in this game. At least that's what it was to start. Uh, and of course, there's a little bit of a storyline that goes with each one as you're working your way out of the castle to try to escape to get to uh, back to your family, right? To King Christian and the, and the rest of your family. So here we go. Level one. There's my timer at the top. 40 seconds is what I have. That's Lydia at the very top. Uh, and the monsters. What you have to do in this one is you have to jump on the top of the monsters. And then knock away that. There, I just died. I ran to the side of the monster. Um, but that's basically what you do is try to clear the level. Get those ones. Jump up and get him. Now, one thing I noticed is if you jump as they're coming up if you jump at all you really don't have to lay on the side you just got to be in the air like that right there and, and you'll kill them so i've lost one man but my lives are still at three so that's okay i'm just going to show you a few a uh, couple of the rounds here or a couple of the lands and then uh, i'll call the that'll be it some of them get more challenging later on and it's hard to actually get everything done with the time there's also some bonus rounds once you get done the first uh land all four rounds it gives you a bonus uh, round to start and all the enemies are already turned over you just got to touch them all and believe me it's friggin challenging because you don't have a whole lot of time but anyway let's get on to the next one. Oh, so i've lost two men already three and notice the arrow when you're coming back on four you can see where you're gonna start oh A little bit more careful here. See, I left him too long. So he turned back over into the monster. He's a little bit quicker, it seems, when you do that. Off the bottom of the screen, onto the top. Again, that's just like Bubble Bobble. I love that. And passwords there as well. You saw on the first screen where you can put a password in to go back. So in this one, you can put the password in. You'll go back to that uh, level. If not round, you'll go back to, the, to that land, I should say. All right. We'll try to be a little bit more careful this time. Two right there to get rid of. You control yourself when you fall, too. You can adjust your angle. There you go. Slide over and get him. Perfect. Oh, they're both right there. There it is. 31 seconds left. Lots of time. This first, obviously, the first uh, land is pretty simple. All right. Try to get some of those guys over there. Oh, he almost turned back on me. There we go. So now we got a little cutscene, and it says. Liddy newsletter at Puny Pine. So I'm going into the Puny Pines. There's a bit of a flicker there, but uh, it's worse right this time than it normally is. But again, beta. They're working on this. So you might see some different cutscene graphics in there too. I don't know for sure. But Liddy newsletter at Puny Pines. That's it. Off we go. Oh, more monsters, but I'll go on. All right, here we go. We're at Puny Pines land now, the second land. Password 6744. Hey, I got them all. So that's your bonus round right there. All right. So now we're back to regular old gameplay. Whoa. See that arrow? That shows you where it's going to pop back up. Oh. Now we got to also see the fireball bouncing around. The fireball hits you, you die. Later on, we'll also have a uh, an ice ball. And there's the level. 14 seconds to spare. Now this one's this one's a little tricky. 
Well, let's go pretty good though. Because it's hard to get in at those ones, right? There it is. Got around that corner and back in. You could do it, you could jump up the different levels when you get over to that middle as well. Okay, look at this one. See, I can't get back up there easy, but I can go up the middle here to get him. There's nothing, no spot in the bottom to jump down. My time's at 20. Oh. Shoot. 15. I got two more to get. Oh, no. See how many men I've lost? Perfect. Okay, so let's get... Jump back up the middle here. Three, two, and I got it with like one second left. So time tends to be as much of a, it makes it as difficult as anything else, right? Nice. Oh. go that level was pretty easy but this is the end now it goes uh lydia bbs sysop and I, oh what's it saying here at winter glide so we're going into winter glide now hit the button and it's gonna, the icy land is very slippery so now we're into an ice land the third one there it is oh this is the bonus stage but winter glide land now, this is crazy slippery never gonna get it so you don't have much time to do that all right so we're the winner's side to play this one last level and then that'll be it for today well you'll see how slippery it is just touch it i'm not even touching it, it just keeps going get those oh look at that as long as you take your time it's still now this guy is tough to get oh the ice ball got me Time, 22. Haha, <laughs> look at that. And we got it. All right. So listen, that's enough for now. Again, in reality, I must have died about 15, 20 times there. So I don't know how I get this far. But practice, practice, practice. Of course, you would get a lot better. So I love Bubble Bobble. And this game is really kind of exciting. Uh, they got a few things to work out still. That's the nature of the beast, right? But it's great to see stuff like this coming. Anyway, let's go back over to the other screen. There we go. And that's Princess Liddy. Uh, when will it be out? I expect it to be out probably in 2025 as well. It's uh, It's got some more work to be done on it. Some more tweaking, some more perfecting, probably some different things added. But it's still pretty exciting to see where it is now compared to where it was way back in the day. Uh, and, of course, any game that of that nature is is just so much fun anyway guys thanks a lot for spending a little bit of time with coco and i here today she's flaked right out and uh don't forget to like comment and subscribe it really does help the channel a lot a ton actually and we will see you in the next video you take care papa p papa p the old ass gamer p papa p the old ass gamer if you have been grown up by the age of Hey, it's Steve Jones from the Steve Jones Box Company. You're watching Papa Pete, the old ass gamer. What the hell?